Hey, oh, it's Usa here, and this is a uh, Psalms commentary. I haven't made one ever on this channel. I attempted to, but it turned out bad. So, I. You guys probably noticed that. Oh, you jerk. That's my window. I hate you. Always take that one. Yes. I love you. Alright. Um. I haven't been posting on my channel for like two weeks now, I think. Or maybe more. Don't yell at me. I'm sorry. I've been. Well, the first week is not my fault. I've been at the cabin, so I'm. I couldn't unless I teleport home or I get Jordan to do it. But you, we all know Jordan. He, he won't remember anything. So, either that, so I didn't do that. But, the other, this week, and probably the other one, I have no idea, when I last posted, um, I've been um, doing swimming lessons. Yes. And I didn't really feel up to making a video. And, because I didn't want to just post a video that's on my computer, because... I wanted to tell you guys why I didn't post for a while, so I've been holding it off and blah blah blah. It would have been better if I just took one off my computer. Um, yeah, but I didn't. So yeah, I'm making one now. And this is a live commentary, so I'm, some parts I might be silent, but my dad might pop in and say some words. Things like, I got a coat just like that. <laughs> yes, random stuff like that. They got workers just like that too. Yeah. Which one? They got all those guys. <laughs> shoot. Oh shit. Yeah. Um, I was I was making a Call of the Dead commentary, but then they all died over and over again, and I had and then we're like round six, and I didn't die at all. I'm not bragging, but I'm just saying. And then, all of a sudden, they all died again. I had the MP40. I was about to get jugged. And then they rage quit. The host rage quit. So that pissed me off a bit. And, yeah. I have some stories about on um, the cabin. And my dad will help me out probably with, if I did something, if I said something wrong or. It's the ticks. It's the ticks. That's the first story I have for you guys. So we went hiking. Because I thought it would be super duper fun to go hiking, right? Because, like, you're in a cabin. Let's go hiking. It's a nice day. And then we're walking in this place that we don't usually go on. I don't know if we have gone on it. But we're on the Trans Canada Trail, right? And then, guess what happens? Ticks are everywhere. Literally, they are everywhere. Tick I nest. Yeah, we were literally walking on top of a tick nest. I, Not good. No. <laughs> Hundreds of ticks. Um, I had like 15 ticks. My dad had... How many do you think oh. he had? The whole week. The whole week? Yeah. 20, 30? I what? 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 Uh, oh yeah. So then, uh, that's my mom. Sorry, I'm sorry if I yelled in your ears. I'm so sorry. Um. Well, we stopped. We stopped at a church. Church. <laughs> sorry. Yeah. I stopped at church because we didn't want to keep on going on the Trans Canada, and we had so many ticks, and we're checking for ticks. Where we were safe from ticks. So we stopped at a church and we were standing on the porch. And then. Uh, um, the wasps came. The wasps came and they were surrounding me. And they were biting me and shit like that. I don't know if they were biting me, but I felt like it. I was panicking because there's wasps on me and there's ticks on me and there's all this shit on me. And I was panicking, and my parents and my sister were ignoring me. They, I was like freaking out, telling them we were to, dealing with ticks. to come help me. 
and everything because I couldn't see my calves if there's ticks on there. Every man for himself. And they were taking care of themselves and they, they didn't even notice me, it felt like. And it sucked ass. Yeah. And it was a horrific, horrific day. And deer ticks. The yeah. Lyme disease ones. Oh, yeah. Mm mm mm. And um, I didn't want to go on another hike after that. No rats, though. Oh, yeah, you're scared of rats, aren't you? Yeah, I'm sure. Nasty. <laughs> well, anyways, um, I didn't want to go on another hike ever again. Because, yeah, we were going to go on lots of hikes that, this, that week. No, it was two weeks, right? We were gone for two weeks? Yeah, a week. I thought it was two weeks. Wasn't it? No, it was only a week. Felt like two. Well, we were going on a lot of hikes because that's what we usually did. We did that once or twice, I think. Because we, I've only been there once or twice that cabin. Usually it's my parents, but for like the honeymoon, no, not the honeymoon, anniversary. But they decided to bring us. And um, so my dad had to talk me into it and saying that don't be scared of them, blah, blah, blah. And it's motivating me. And um, I decided to go and then I decided not, what the heck? Like, and then I decided not to go and then I decided to go and then. Here you're dead. Yeah, because it's the leg. Why did they get jumping up and down? No idea. What the heck? Play! Don't just stand there and teabag everything. Come on. And then, it's very awesome. We get, I, I'm happy that I decided to go on those two other hikes. No, no, we're at, yeah, there's two other hikes, right? Yeah. Yeah, and there's six hours each, pretty much. It was a long hike. Oh, my workers. Oh, <laughs> you're shooting my workers. Yeah, it was so much fun. <laughs> my sister's here, and she's wondering why I'm talking to this. Yeah. You have a what? Yeah, I have one. It's really good. What's wrong? I don't have a weekend off that we're going along the or all this long weekend, Canada. Oh, <laughs> lucky you. I gotta work. Oh, that's your excuse, huh? You just don't like the candy. No, I didn't even know that until today. I have a solution. What is it? Okay, you know how you didn't want to ask somebody to switch with you because then they have to work three weeks, right? Right. But what if you ask somebody to work for you, so then they'll be working two weekends in a row, right? Right. And normally they would have to work the next weekend too, right? But what if you work that weekend instead? So you work, he works two weekends, and then you work two weekends in a row, but then after that, he has the next weekend, so it goes back to normal. Yeah, it would. Solution. But he's going to agree to work 18 hours. Or 18 days. That's when you put on your puppy face and you're like... Have you been in my workplace in the last couple of weeks since the heat's gone through no, the roof? No, but that's better than having to work three weeks. I have a hard enough time getting into work every day, <laughs> let alone 18 days. But maybe you could do him a favor, like buy him a case of beer or something. Oh, beer always really solves everything. Beer is good. Yeah, see? That's my solution for you. I thought I was pretty smart coming up with this. No. Way, yeah, so, Dad, you're lucky. You should be happy. No, you don't have to go camping. Because now you guys are there by yourselves. No, oh, yeah, don't leave us alone. Not with them. What's wrong with my solution? Everything. It's broken. Shut up. Oh, that's fast. I know, it's a freaking fast bugger. It's not one of my workers, then. No, it's their slow. You turn on the power. All right. So dad is my dad is not going to our camping thing. Annual. Annual camping thing with our cousins and our immediate, not our immediate, our families. Well, I'm running rivals. Get old to get that game. It's 
What the heck? They're right behind you. I know. They kept going. Huh? They are stupid. They didn't turn around once. No, 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 they died because I knew. Oh. So I knew they were going to die. So yeah. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> Juggernaut. Dang it. I have to go soon. Alright, I'm going to leave it for this episode. I'm going to make another episode yet. Alright, see you in a second.